Hello, welcome back to Access Granted. I'm Nath. I'm here with Dave. Hello. Dave, we're back. Yeah. Quiet week, isn't it? It's been a quiet, oh, yeah. quiet week really, all round. Nothing really going on. I could remember. Everyone who isn't living in Britain. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Dave, I've pulled out a quote to cheer myself up. There. Okay. Uh, it just says, Johanna, Johanna says, Finally, with lots of whys, Nathan, the champion of champions. And I wanted to set the tone early. What? I wanted to set the tone early. This is just one of many reactions to last week's one on onesie, you've which people flooded the comments unbidden. One game did, in I didn't, five you've won. I didn't write this, I didn't, you know, post it up, but I have found it. Plus, that I'm makes me up. a champion as well. You're the no, champion right. of champions. I'm the actual champion, aren't I? Because I champion. won last time, didn't I? Yeah, but I'm also so a champion because you're the champion of champions. That's correct, I'm the champion of champions. Uh, oh, this great. week, though, we're going to have, uh, there's going to be more one on onesie. Uh, we've got comments of the week coming up. We've got a very special announcement day. Have we? Yeah, genuinely. Oh, like, I'm quite excited. a good announcement. Good. Um, and we've got the 301 Club, but first... The time for truth is nearly here. Bringing tales of lies and fear to stand a chance at gaming heaven. Reveal to us your game confession. Game confessions. Yeah. I've got to confess something, Dave. Very serious time. These, are, these are slowing down and we're going to have to think of something else soon. Really? Yeah. They're, they're Don't quite, make us do another quite thing. Good if you guys have got any ideas, do you know what, actually, guys? Both picked with these guys. Really? There were fewer comments this week than, uh, than normal. <gasps> I mean, quite, it's quite significantly fewer. What does it mean? You know, which is good because it took me less time to go through them. But yeah. at the same time, come on. <laughs> You've got to get in touch. This is a feedback show <laughs> where we need your feedback. Imagine to have if a we show. didn't have any comments. We just, just do one on one. I think some people did actually call for that. Oh, they week. would like that, yeah. So if you've got any comments, you know, then let us know. Anything about anything on the channel whatsoever, you can put it in the Access Granted comments and we'll find it for the week after. And obviously it's Gaming Confessions, which I'll start with now. Okay. Uh, Loyal Songbird says, Gaming Confessions, this is super lame, but I'm too afraid to play Witcher 3 during the game in the night time, during the game. Uh, I always have Geralt meditate until sunup. Neckers at night are tearing, terrifying to me. I just, thought, I just thought I'd bring that up because I like The Witcher a lot and I've been playing it a lot lately. And um, I don't, I do, I, a similar thing, I don't do it because I'm scared, that is pathetic. But um, <laughs> I do it I do it because I prefer the weather during the day. And if, sometimes if it's raining, I will just skip to the next day. Yeah. And also, I also have only just really, you know sometimes when you pull like a subconscious thought into your conscious mind and you yeah. look at it. I've also realised that something I do is that I set sometimes my, my like Geralt alarm for like six or seven in the morning. Right. And then I get that feeling, you know, when you wake up early and it's nice and sunny. Yeah. And you go about you and you're like, I've got so much done and it's only eight o'clock in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> I get that feeling sat on my sofa like this. Right, yeah. It, I, I think I quite like it. I quite like the idea of... Uh, you know, it's like an extra level of role playing as well, isn't it? Yeah. Got to find Geralt to bed. Like you can only meditate it's in a one bed. one level. I, I don't do that. It's funny I though because you, uh, if it's raining outside, you don't t come, tend to come to work that day either. I. Uh, what happened was I was stuck for about 15 minutes outside of Starbucks. <laughs> so I'm sorry about that, Dave. I really got the train to work, but I didn't want to ruin my jeans. So. Uh, so <laughs> and I the latte was excellent. Um, I don't have a. I'm not a latte <laughs> drinker. I had a, I had a strong black americano, medium. <laughs> um, no, no, they came out a bit more nasal than I was hoping. <laughs> Medium. Um, What's next? Have we got? Well, I was actually I was just going to I was going to say about The Witcher as well. Yesterday mm. I got uh, I got stuck in a hole in a marsh, and right. I, I had to reload the game. Um, oh. And it was a bit of a try. No, it's a bit of a tragedy. I've not told you about this before, which is uh, unlike me because yeah. I tell you every tiny boring <laughs> thing that happens to me. But I went. I was basically. Um, I'm at the stage now where I'm about to get a boat to Skellige. I finished all the story missions in Novigrad. Okay. And then I had a look at the world map. I was, I was thinking like I'll do some of the Witcher contracts before I'm so over leveled that they're meaningless. Yeah. So I've, started, I've been going back through like Velen and all the swamps, and there's like loads of. I've become obsessed with like finding question marks on the map and like finding out what they are. Yeah. And yesterday I found some guarded treasure. Just, um, just near the witches of Crookback Bog, mm. um, and it was, um, uh, it was, I can't remember which. It was the ladies that kind of, the the, the hags that yeah. are in the water, and they kind of disappear and then pop back up. Um, and I killed her, and then I got the treasure, and then a fiend came over. I've never seen a fiend, mm. massive, and I was really scared of it. Yeah. And it had like a horn, and um, um, I don't know what we're going to show while I'm telling this story. Nothing. Probably it's my nothing. Face. It's your face. I'm uh, going to slowly zoom in. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, and, I, and anyway, I attacked it and I killed it. And just literally, I, as I killed it, I got, well, as it was really low on health, I got caught in this like just little hole, just part of the terrain of the field, but it was water. 
and I used Igni and I like used my a sign to kill it and I was like oh, I can't wait to get up there I'm gonna loot that it's yeah. gonna be great and then I just like for about 10 minutes just going round and round in this little hole in the ground I couldn't I get out know. just up to my chest in water it was like so what happened? Some. Uh, well I, I was battering stuff trying to get like did swords yeah. did all my signs um, in the end I saved it beneath the auto save it just right. in case I was stuck there forever and I didn't want to ruin my game. Yeah. And then I loaded the autosave and I was able simply to walk out of one end of it, right. but the fiend had gone. Oh. And then I reloaded the other save and the fiend had gone there as well. Oh. So isn't that... I, I mean, that's The only fiend you've ever seen, you haven't got to loot I've him yet. I've completely interrupted gaming confessions. But, yeah, you have. Um, I mean, this is a, we've actually three weeks Maybe we should have, Maybe now. my section should just be stuff that's happened to Nathan the Witcher <laughs> this Nathan's week. Nathan's week. The Witcher week. Um, Dung Beetle Gaming says, Gaming Confession. I was in a chat with my friend while playing The Witcher 3. I'm, I'm subconsciously, obviously, I've, there's a theme here this week, sorry. And my sister entered my room and asked me to come off my PS4. So instead I told her I was in the middle of a multiplayer game and my friend was playing as Roach. And she completely <laughs> believed me and let me be. Best Your friend I've isn't very good, told. is he? <laughs> I love that idea though. My friend, I can't stop. My friend's my horse. I can't break up the game. Yeah. Because he's, you know, what's he doing? Just name? Yeah. Just teleporting towards well, you? We had one a few weeks ago, didn't we? Where someone was playing Metal Gear Solid V, The Phantom Pain, and told their, like, four-year-old that they were playing as D-Dog. Right. Who's a, oh. an unplayable dog. Dog, yeah. <laughs> that That's dog great. Character. You're doing great, D-Dog. Mikey Corbett, Gaming Confessions, spoilers. <gasps> I know. What for? I really enjoyed playing Minecraft Story Mode. Oh. I became that invested in the characters that, have you... Played to the end of Minecraft on you? No, I haven't. Have you played any Minecraft? No, I haven't. Me neither. Let's continue. Uh, I cried real man tears when the pig dies at the end. Oh no. I've never cried at any game and I'm 29 years of age. Oh the shame. To top it all off, my partner looked at the screen as the pig vanished and asked, what's it turned into? And I replied mid-sob, it's a pork chop. <laughs> and continued to cry. <laughs> Well, which I really like. Oh, that's so I think that's great. I don't think you know. I'm sorry that that's affected you in such a way. Although it's yeah. nice, isn't it? nice to to have that's true, to, real emotions. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And pigs are nice in the real world. I quite like them. Good commentary, Dave. Just um, saying. <laughs> I think it's okay. So the, this this last one, Dave, you'll be thrilled to know that a man for the first time ever has got two comments into one episode of Access Granted. Blimey. Matt Budes. That's amazing. Hashtag gaming confession. Last year I saw one of Rob's Friday features under my recommended videos. I found him annoying, so never watched the channel again. Quite right. A couple months later, I watched the Let's Play. I subscribed right then. Dear Rob, I've come round to love you as well. I must have been having a bad day. I'm sorry, from a dear Canadian. <laughs> <laughs> Was Rob in the Let's Play, I wonder? I don't know, maybe not. Maybe Because you, know, you probably would have immediately gone, not this annoying guy again. Fact, you need to build up a tolerance to Rob. Well, first he needs to be diluted one third as part of all of us having a game. Yeah. And then you can maybe go on to the sterner stuff of the Rob Friday features. It's very rare to hear of of it going that way around from 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 us assume, you know I'm assuming you're saying. to Rob usually yeah. people watch Rob and they go what's this other I rubbish I thought you were going to say it's very rare to hear people going from being annoyed with Rob at first to then not being annoyed oh yeah no that's rather right rather than thinking he's alright and then getting more and more annoyed or just time. starting at annoyed and on. then just staying there yeah those are the more normal options aren't they yeah it's time it's time it's time it's time for comments, comments of, of the week. week comments of the week Dave but yes. before we do that <gasps> An actual announcement. My God. We have got, we're going to have t-shirts. What? I've got a t-shirt. We're going to see it on screen <laughs> right now. No, insert coin, who I'm sure loads of people who watch the channel will know. Mm. They make uh, some of like, some, you know, like for a long time, if you were a gamer and you wanted a t-shirt which reflected your interest, you had to wear rubbish. Um, <laughs> and Insert Coins is one of uh, one of a few companies who are like doing good stuff, imaginative things, and uh, we've teamed up with them. And they've like they've, there's a T-shirt you can buy on their website. Dave. It's quite surreal, isn't it? I know. You can see Rob modelling it very enthusiastically oh, yeah. now. Don't give up the day job. He Rob. really didn't want to stop doing that. Um, you can you can buy these now, Dave. I will. There's no pre-ordering. They're available now. They're in stock. No. From the Insert Coin website. This is like one of those great E3 reveals. I know, right? And you can buy these right now right at InsertCoinClothing.com. We'll put the description in the link below. No, you know, swap those Yeah, the other around. way around. Yeah, they ship worldwide as well. That's the other thing, because we've got fans all over the place, and sometimes stuff like um, the app and the theme, they're only in certain places in the world. But this can be anywhere that you are as long as you, you know, pay for it to get there. So there's no excuse. 
There's no excuse not to have one of these t-shirts exactly. on your body. We, we should stress, they're limited numbers. Right. They're available right now. They went live at um, four o'clock today. So that, I mean, if you get over there now, you'll probably be fine. But if you want one, go and get one. It's got Delsin on it. Yeah. It's, a, it's, a place, it's the only official PlayStation Access t-shirt. That's cool. And if people have got any questions, they can tweet at insert coin tees, which uh, Dave, you can make a nice third for that. No, <sighs> just put it in the description. Wait, is it that way? It's that way, I think. No. Well, comments of the week, <laughs> let's everybody. Crack on. So that is good. If you if you're interested in getting a t-shirt with Delson on it, then uh, then head over to Insert Coin. Um, Monkeys Forever. Now we're back on topic, Dave. Great name. Uh, should have played as Iceland, Dave. Which is a reference to last week. Oh. Hours before England. Uh, I already joked about the fact that we had put that up just in time for us to go out of Europe. I didn't think it was going to be then. No. I thought we were going to lose to Ireland in a few days after that. No, yeah. Portugal. Well, um, well done to Iceland. I thought they were excellent and I look forward to supporting them. They were really good. Onwards in their we were, journey. We were terrible and they were really good. Yeah. Well done, Iceland. Um, what's this now? Suit Tree BJ. Uh, been avoiding watching Access Granted because didn't like to see Nate lose. Not to say, I don't like to see Dave win, just like it to be even. But grats, Nate, on your victory. Hopefully you can pull out a couple more. Can't wait to see you guys do Tekken 7 next year. Nor can I. We should have a whole season just oh, on Tekken you, 7. You just assume that you're going to be better at Tekken 7 than me. Yeah, I do. Yeah. Well, really? Really? That sounds like fighting talk. What do you, I think that's fighting talk. Yeah, digital fight. I, everyone agrees uh, with me. That's <laughs> I'm gonna what I do, want. I'm going to start a Tekken montage now then. Training montage. Good. Well, good. Um, Bawali Akonde says, And so the comeback begins. Hashtag <laughs> Team Nate. Oh, I see. There's uh, a lot I should of these, never mate. have let you do the comments this week. Can I? This is propaganda. One more. Just one, one more. more. And there were loads of these. And I only included this for a reason. Uh, Michelle Diamond. Hi, Dave and Nath. A big hello from Melbourne, Australia. I like that. Yeah. Um, I so love PlayStation Access. I look forward to watching the show every week. Love one on one So freaking cool seeing you guys go at it, lol. A bit close to the mark there. Anyway, keep up the good work. And I like that uh, Michelle is, is Mishy. Or Mishi, maybe. <laughs> Just because it's so Australian. And also, I was thinking about Australia is one of the few things that was cheering me up this week because obviously we beat them. Didn't oh, we? yeah, and the rugby, that was good, wasn't we it? Beat them. So oh, thanks it. for being nice to us, and I'm glad we beat you. But, <laughs> uh, but we did read your comment out, so that's something. Um, Reedy Gamer 14. Uh, that was a live action replay of Gareth Bale free kick against England. <laughs> It was, as yeah, well. you're absolutely right. He asked Joe Hart standing in the middle of his goal. See, I mean, let's find an excuse to play this brilliant goal that I scored in kickoff revival every week. Let's show it now. <laughs> and you complaining about this perfect goalkeeping. I have Unbelievable. No, no idea what I was talking wrong. about. Uh, and what's this now? The tell namer says, Nate. This is a nice one for you. Leave that nice man alone with the scary games. I still hear him say, this is my life. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, what kind of job is this where you need a safe word? <laughs> I'm putting it like that, mate. This is brilliant. <laughs> He's so right. He's so right. This is my life. He's absolutely this right. Is my Nailed life. it. That's what I assume you said that while you were bleeding in one of these videos. I can't remember when I said it, but I was right then and I'm right now. It is. I, what kind of job is it where I need a safe word? And then, well, in contrast to that, from um, this is a comment from the uh, Here They Lie VR horror uh, playthrough, which I did. I enjoyed that. Ryan Davis says, Dear PlayStation Access, thank you for not having Dave play this game because we wouldn't have seen any of it. Well, exactly, you're absolutely scary. right. Yeah, that's true. So, and by that logic, I just shouldn't play any of the scary games. Shut People are interested in the games, not in me mouth. crying, Shut which is mouth. what they would see. Ooh. The hat. Oh, you know what this means. The one some people might not. They have no idea what we're doing. We are doing. We are pulling out a game for this week's one on onesie. Is it going to be have good for me? A piece of paper. The game is Wonder Shot, which is a powerful. Is that good or bad game. for me? I don't, I don't know. know. I've I've played the tutorial, ah. so I'm probably favourite. We're equally matched at Towerfall. Let's go. This is gonna be one on ones. <laughs> Wonder of Wondershot. Hmm.
Um, this is a game where we fire different... There's four different types of weapons. Yeah. I think we're just in small arenas, and we run around shooting each other. It's not unlike Towerfall Ascension. Mm. But or in a way, it's a bit like Stick Bowl, which also we completely enjoyed different. a lot. I'm red. I'm player I'm two. Good. I've got, I've got, got, got a boomerang. Oh! Ooh. Oh, yes. Uh, you've made a mistake there, my friend. Oh, have I? Oh, my God. Oh, God damn it. This so is really hard. So you get your weapon back if you... Uh, when you fire a projectile, if it doesn't hit... You have to go and find then it. Then you have to go and get it. We're doing, we're doing, what is this, first to ten? It's not best of ten, is it? Yeah, first, first ten. to ten. What's happened? There's a lot here suddenly that I wasn't, I wasn't really, like, accounting for. Oh, my God, you can hit through. Yes. Oh, perfect. Yes. What does perfect shot mean? <laughs> what have I got? Let's fight. I've got, I've got the bow and arrow. I'm really confused. Don't I be confused. Oh, no. that is a oh. hell of a shot. I was about Ultimate to use my warrior. phasing ability, and it just didn't work. Look, I'm holding it down. I've actually gone for it. Hmm. What to do? Ooh. Oh, that is the oh as lucky as you could get. Hup. I've got a roll as well. Oh, wait! Suddenly, I've got the I had the bow and arrow. I was so confused. Oh man! Oh, I've pressed the wrong button there. Interruption. What's up, man? Thought in the game. Cool. In Thought the you game. were playing it cool. Don't worry about it. I didn't shout. Just please, I'm on the board. Well, wait a minute. Oh, I thought I had the boomerang. Shut up, Dad. I thought I had the boomerang. <laughs> I, that's not oh. fair. Oh, 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 oh. How is it not fair? You have not deserved applause yet. I've had unstoppable, incredible. Oh, you were lucky there, my friend. You were lucky. I've got your hammer now. Uh-oh. Oh! No! No! <laughs> I need oh the my. hammer back. Oh my. Get the hammer. Fleet of foot. Oh my goodness me! No! Yes! No! That is mad. Picked up loads of stuff <laughs> in Cambridge. Look at the shot homing you. shot. The, the, oh, just the arrow uh, does home a little bit, doesn't it? Okay, yeah. what have I got? Speaking of arrows. Homing arrows. Go on, arrows! Oh, they do! Yeah! They do! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I feel tense. Not gonna lie. I feel tense. I was just hoping that might just hurt you. Ooh, hello. I can't get it yet. That's annoying. I want it. Wait. Hello. Oh, you were lucky. Oh, yes. No, I fired. Yeah. I f oh, no. Fire. Uh, roll. Roll. Shut up, Dave. <laughs> I want to roll. Hammer time. We got a roll, I rolled right into a stupid rock. Look at me. Look at me. Oh, no way. We didn't see that coming. I've got an issue here. Uh oh. Oh. Stay behind the stupid things. No, Frodo! <laughs> I don't know why there's a Frodo. No! Ah! Uh, fire! Fire! Oh! Yes! Ah, that one felt like a big point. Oh! No, it's only even. <laughs> yeah, but it felt big. Can I go through walls? Mm, nope. <laughs> Okay, oh, here yeah, we yeah. go. Oh, Kadoki. Need some super speed. Do these stack? Fire. Doesn't matter, you're dead. My good God, that was impressive. Oh, he's got, he's got a better range than the... Uh, oh, I see. Oh, no. Fire. Damn. Oh. Ah, oh, look at that lead now. That's an imposing lead for me now. Three left to get those. I mean, that's a long time. I'm finding it imposing. I don't have the lead. <laughs> I know no where to go. Away. No, we're getting Just away rolling. from that. I was thinking, can I bounce this off anything? And then I was dead. I, I should have fired it through the portal. Damn, I don't like. I don't like being against the arrow. Oh, you are kidding me! You are awful with a boomerang, young lady. I'm stuck. What's that? Phantom. Ghost. Oh, it's like oh, yes. How are you not dead? Yes. How, genuinely, how are you not dead? Because Let's have a look. look at this. I'm applauding. But, <laughs> but I'm well, also thinking, see it. maybe I'll press start two again. Oh, okay. Ah, not the hammer. No. That's right. That's that's fine. Oh, you yeah. can go through walls, can't you? go through walls with the hammer. God it makes perfect it. sense. <laughs> Doesn't make any sense. Woo! I got now. I've got the hammer. If I had a hammer, 
Ooh. The bad thing about the hammer is that it shows me where you're, you know. What have I got? I just fired it without having any clue as to what I've got, and now I don't have anything. Shouldn't have told you that. That's bad. This is bad for me. Here we go. Super speed. Roll. Roll, roll. Roll, roll, roll your boat. You're dead. You're oh. so dead. Oh, that was annoying. Oh, it would come down oh to a two-point a two point game. Oh, no. I wanted that. No! Oh, my God. What have I got again? Oh, yeah. Oh, boomerang. How have you failed me oh there? My God, have I, I even caught got it? A, have I got the boomerang? No, you've got the boomerang. Oh, I've caught well, it. What do I get? I don't know, mate. I've got to get the Super projectile. Shot. This is bad. Fire. No! Yes! How is yes! that a stupid yes! super shot? Yeah. And it's not killing you! You've got to be a better shot with the super shot. Match point. Unbelievable. Match point. I've got my beloved hammer that I don't beloved at all. In fact. Oh! 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 Ah! Uh. Oh! No! I hit you! <laughs> <laughs> how did I not oh. hit you? How, oh. Genuinely though, how did I not hit you? Genuinely though, get in the onesie. They've got the skills to know When it's time to watch our next video They're the ones we love 301 Club Better than the comments above 301 not going to put the hood up then? Not this week. No? No. We're getting better staying stages though, aren't we? We're getting back to wearing the onesie in very gradual stages. Man, so that was close though, wasn't it? That was, that really, was close. really close. It was close. And it, it you know, I but thought you... It's been close. It's been close every game. Maybe I got whitewashed in one That's game. That's it. The, and then the first playthrough of, of, uh, of N++. That was really close. Yeah, but I still won. Y yeah, yeah, yeah. And then obviously the next time I just went mad. Yeah, yeah, you did go mad. It's uh, great. But so yeah. that is that is a substantial lead. Now I thought, you know, you I'm need, really worried this week. I thought you need one more to win this season. Yes. That is interesting. I was really worried that if you won this week, that yeah. my head would be gone. Yeah, I know. Because you are, you got your. If it yeah, gone 4-2, I mean, I'd be like, oh no. Psychologically, you are fragile. That's why. That's my weak spot. Is my brain. <laughs> when you thought when I brought it back to five <laughs> all in that, in that game. You thought that you yeah, lost I know. it. It's funny, isn't it? And funny, I, I really have I, no... I wasn't good enough at the game. No self-esteem, really. I really wanted R2 to be shooting. Really wanted it to be shooting. It wasn't. Yeah. It was doing my mind. Right, 301 Club. Yes. Four entries into the 301 Club. You're going to have to pick the winner at the end, Dave. Because right. I put no thought into it. Okay. I've been holding this upside down the whole time. Yeah, it's fine. Um, it's one of its features. Matt Buse is back. Okay. Okay. 301 Club. Woo oo, best day ever, and my son was born on June the 11th. We named him Dave after you, Dave. <gasps> Not really. Oh. My wife doesn't like you. <laughs> she prefers Nathan, <laughs> so we call him Owen. <laughs> <laughs> well, that is a very strong start. <laughs> that, that is that good, was, right? That was a roller coaster ride <laughs> that I really was on board with. So. Ya Yannick Brugmans, hashtag 301 Club. If I could be 301 King for, I just like this one, it's quite nice. Yeah. For a week, I'd release David from his shackles that are horror games and ban onesies for Nathan. Oh, wow. Then again, a nation needs a good laugh, so it's probably not going to happen. Uh. There might be cookies though. Another roller coaster. Yeah. Thanks, Yannick. Stay tuned, says 301 Club. I think it's all so overwhelming. What are your favourite games to play when you're sick or off work? Mine is the last of us, just so I know things could be worse. And I've chosen this, Dave, no joke. Not really realising that I'd already done this, but because I was going to say The Witcher. Oh, for God's sake, I know, Dave. I've gone mad. Have you played any other games <laughs> ever? No, I've, <laughs> I've got so many games lined up, but I'm just going to be playing The Witcher for just for, for, ages. for the foreseeable future. Yeah, that's all I like. Okay. Would well, you want to answer that question, though? Because I quite like it. Is there something in particular I play when I'm off sick or...? or yeah. Um, I well, if I'm feeling sad, I'm I can't play anything sad. I have to play something very, very happy. Mm. So something like the Witcher. you know, <laughs> the Witcher's pretty good. No, the, probably not the Witcher actually. Something I like a shorter experience. Maybe something like a FIFA, okay. or uh, like a Lego Star Wars. Something along those lines. Yeah. Okay. You know, like a happy. We might be playing some Lego Star Wars. Or Tear Away Unfolded. Ah. Oh. Anyway, uh, Little Miss Leia or Leia says. And this is, this is, I like the simplicity of this. I think people have been really trying to make an effort. 
301 club, you've got to get in there. Yeah. If the count's under 301, but then sometimes people are worried about by the time they've done their comment, it's like, well, what's that? Yeah, true. She just says, I love you all. I really mean that. Wow, that's Which I really like. Very, that's very nice. I, really yeah. like. I mean, I've got I a favourite here, I, I think, Dave. So you've got to choose the winner. Right, well, my winner is uh, definitely Matt Bude. Matt Bude. I mean, I really was. The Canadian man. I really was with him on that, you know, that ride of a comment. I've got no idea whether he's really had a child or if he's married, I but know. it just made me laugh anyway. If he had called it Dave, I was certain it wasn't named after me. Yeah. But I liked, yeah. I liked that. It was great. Just it had everything. It out, pulled it back. Yeah. So there we go. Matt Bude's King 301 Club. Congrats. What else have we got coming up this week, Dave? Oh, man. Uh, we have just we have just did last week on Thursday uh, a video about Skyrim, which you can go and see. It's probably like and then there was like Rob's Friday feature. I didn't mention that oh, just yeah. because I really I enjoyed it. I really enjoyed it because I was kind of watching you and Rob putting it together, uh, and yeah. I've obviously not played any Skyrim, and I was no, just I thinking like this is going to be great. I also enjoyed you just like desperately trying to jump up a mountain uh, for yeah. like an hour I know. to capture the top of that. I really enjoyed making that video actually, it was really good fun to like go back to Skyrim, it's a fantastic game. You know what I'm going to say now as well, it, watching you make it made me think what I'd like to make <laughs> is maybe a locations video about the Witcher. About the Witcher? About the Witcher, yeah. I didn't I don't know, know you were you into The Witcher. I, I know, I've been keeping oh, it quiet, but really? I really do. So I mean how about guys, if you have if you've got any suggestions for like other games that we could do like a uh, treatment like that, you know, like go and see these best locations in this game, let us know in the comments. And if you've got specifically places in The Witcher that your favourite that you think we could put in a video like that, say if the video is going to be, you know, 10 places you need to see in The Witcher before you're dead, um, then, uh, you know, you could, sorry, I don't know why I did that. And then, oh, oh, off my stride. Really, honestly, oh, yeah. I love The, the Witcher. The onesie. I love other it. Other things, Nathan. We've what? been playing Deus Ex. Sorry, right. I don't know when it's on the channel. Okay. I thought you were asking me for more things. No, sorry. no, sorry, I was going to bring some things to the table. Okay. Yeah. We've been playing Deus Ex. That's yep. coming. That is. We're going to another event that I'm not sure we can talk about, but that's coming. We definitely can't. Okay. But it's to, sh to keep you updated with the game that a lot of you are enjoying. Holly was supposed to come down last week to unbox something, but she couldn't, so yes, she's, coming, correct. she's coming down today. And she's bringing a whole bunch of games with her, yeah. which we're going to be recording next door. Exactly. We so can probably gonna... say that. I think there's going to be like an absolute playthrough with Rob. Okay, I like that you still whispered a little I bit. Know, just like how, we're, not so how the, video works. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> and <laughs> some other true. games. Yeah, there's another and, one. As and well. the big unboxing that we've been talking about. Yeah, it's not uh, good, but yeah. And, it's and Rob's got another Friday it's feature. It's there, and the store. And basically, it's full, uh, it's full I thought week. we were going to be quiet after E3, but it's still still. And just we're still going talking on, about it? getting some more time with PlayStation VR as well. So. Yes, I know. I'm it's all about that. it's all right. It's all go. It's all happening. Yeah. Stick with us. Let us know your gaming confessions. Let us know if you've got like a good idea for what could replace gaming confessions. Because I think we are going to have to replace it quite soon. Oh, no. And if it's not Witcher time. Then uh, you know. Is it squad goals? Think of oh, 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 I just suddenly heard the theme tune. Um, uh, or as ever, do get in your comments. Just you know, let us know what you've been watching. Let us know what games you're interested in. Uh, just be fun. You know, this community is really good. Actually, I love going through the comments every week. Yeah. Make my job next time I do that good, please. <laughs> and it, actually, we're kind of running out of uh, one on onesie games too. So any kind of local multiplayer stuff you think might be fun that you've not seen on our channel before, give us a shout. Otherwise, thank you for watching. I've enjoyed it this week, even though I'm in the onesie. I hope you've enjoyed it as well. I've, I've enjoyed it very much, especially because you're in the in the onesie now. So, so thanks for that. Bye. Bye. Bye.